Hey friends, Toni Morrison is one of my favorite authors and she once said, if there's a story in you that you want told and it hasn't been written, then you must write it. By the same token, I have found out over the past couple of years that poetry is a bomb for the soul. You see, I've never thought of myself as a poet, but in late 2021, December of 2021, one early morning at 5 a.m. when I typically write, I woke up as usual to write a chapter in my novel in progress that I'm still working on, and out of me poured this poem. The title came to me, the verses came to me, it just came to me as, as, as if I were the muse for it. And I truly believe that I was the muse for that poem. It was called The Pivot. And as you may remember, we were coming out of the pandemic. Uh, there had been so many losses globally and personally in our lives. And that poem resonated with me on the morning that I wrote it. I remember it was like it was yesterday. And honestly, it has resonated with me since then. Because see, what I didn't realize was that I was going to enter a year, a hard season of 2022, where I was going to be dealing with headaches every day for five months from January until May, where I was going to be unable to write during that period, let alone read, I was entering a season that caused me to slow down and pause and guess what? Pivot. So that poem, The Pivot, is especially personal to me because it helped me endure a season. And as I was coming out of that season and entering 2023 and a new level, feeling way better, feeling a lot better, I realized that we all have to pivot in life. Now, I shared this poem at the inspirational brunch that I hosted in October of 2022. I shared it at the end of the, of the uh, speech I gave, sharing about my journey through living with the headaches and how I come to realize that we're not what we do. I'm not just a writer. I'm not just an author. We are our inner being. We are the calling and purpose beyond that. I know that my calling is to be an encourager, and I believe that I was given that poem to share at that brunch on the stage in October 2022. And here we are in October 2023. And I believe I'm blessed and gifted and called to share this poem with you in book form. So this is what it is. This is my surprise that I've talked about on social media. I've shared in a few other places. I have written a single poem, chat book, we shall call it. It's not a full length book. It's a poem. It's one poem. And it's in this book, it's called The Pivot. It's the back cover. This beautiful cover, front and back, was designed by a dear, dear artist friend of mine, Dawn Edge Campbell. Um, I love her work. It reflects what this poem means to me, to other women, I hope. I, I don't think I would birth this poem just for me. I believe I birthed it for all of us, especially women who dance through life, who have to be resilient in so many ways. If you see this woman, she's dancing, She's pivoting. She's holding regular shoes, not ballerina shoes, because it's not always pretty. She's got the high heels. Sometimes we've got to like tiptoe in those high heels to get through whatever our life's pivot is. So I wrote this poem, I believe, for me, and I believe I wrote it for you. And I invite you to get your copy of it uh, today. 